Hi everybody, if you're watching this, it's time for the Sunday Makeup Basket Debrief and new items for the week. However, um, I am looking slightly disheveled. I'm filming this on the Sunday and um, I just got back from my trip. So uh, being that most of my items are packed away, I'm going to show you my new items that I'm going to use for this upcoming week uh, with some apologies and possibly snippets of things that I used uh, last week and how they worked for me, etc, etc. The wedding was fantastic. Um, it was just a good time. I'm very glad I went. I uh, wish I had gone for a longer amount of time, um, but you take what you can get, right? You got a full-time job, you got to be back. You can't always do what you want. On to the products. For uh, primer, I'm going to be using two things. My Marcel Hydra C Radiance Ultralight Mattifying Fluid. And I'm going to give out a try, give this one the Avene uh, Mattifying Fluid, which was a gift to me from uh, Pebbles Flintstone. So we're going to give this a try. It's a nice size sample, actually. For foundation, something that I acquired um, from the Shopping Channel from one of their Today's Showstoppers. It's the Pure Minerals 4-in-1 Liquid 14-Hour Wear Foundation SPF 15. Now, I hadn't tried this once because I have. And I'm going to tell you right now, the 15 hour or 14 hour wear is no that's just not true um, it's not true I I like the foundation uh, 14 hours is not true so I was blotting the heck out of this um, towards the end of my work day uh, so yeah no, no 14 hours. so for concealer the covergirl and Olay I rehab 2-in-1 brightening concealer which I love probably one of my more liked drugstore concealers along with the L'Oreal True Match uh, Super Blendable Crayons. I love those too. For eyebrows, uh, the Glamorous Pencil and the cap is going, going, gone on this so I don't know. I'm thinking I should probably add some tape here because we've still got quite a bit of uh, pencil to go and it is a good product so I don't want to get rid of it. Uh, the, another favorite of mine, Carol Baker Winter Bronze. I love this stuff. I just love it. A quad that I'm just absolutely in love with, the Annabelle Chai Chai Chai. So, and the colors especially, just perfection. Just a great set of neutrals that you can do so much with. Um, and I'm just pleased with the how creamy and soft they are. That's one of my number one things with eyeshadows. I like the ones that are creamy and soft. Um, and they have a beautiful finish. Pure Minerals uh, Rose in, or blush in Diamond Rose, their most popular color. I ended up last week and uh, for the wedding using a blush that was in one of my Lorac palettes that actually is very similar to this. So um, we'll give it a shot and maybe I'll do a comparison. Something I put in last week's basket but didn't wear, so it's going back into the rotation, is my Chanel Quad. This is in Sable, I believe, 37. So, and again, nice, simple, neutral look. The brown does have shimmer, but it's not like glitter. It's shimmer. For gloss, I'm going with two options. My NYX, this is T-Rose, a gift to me from Stacy Sunnyside Makeup. I happen to love it very much. And Pure Minerals, this one's called Lust Desire, Lust or Desire, yeah, it's more of a neutral, lighter pink. Then uh, for lipstick, uh, Revlon, one of my new loves, Revlon 477 Black Cherry, love these super lustrous lipsticks, don't be afraid of these, because that's what you get. I know it looks incredibly scary, but that's what you get. And they're so soft. And then finally, a new product, my MAC in Extreme Dimension Last Mascara. And this is in the color Black Extreme. I am not a huge MAC mascara wearer, but we're going to give this a try. Um, I'm going to have to really go through and clean out my mascaras. They are getting old and starting to really uh, show that on my lashes, the one that I used over the weekend at the wedding. Uh, I had a lot of second thoughts about bringing that because uh, I thought it was fairly new, but it just was not performing. And I know it was waterproof, but there's no excuse for all those clumps. 
so and I definitely don't expect it so that is all um, just because I'm just showing you the new products so I hope you all had a great weekend and I'll be back to my normal debriefing and new items for the week self next week have a good one bye